Hi, this is a Yesterday's Moose production, and today we're continuing our adventure in Wario Land, Super Mario Land Part 3. In the previous episode, we were in Rice Beach, and we're going to go back there before we start Mount Teapot. And the reason for that is because apparently there is an alternate exit in level 3. So I'm going to try to uh, unlock that and also get some stuff, because stuff is good. Now I have to admit, I did peek ahead for this particular section of the game. At least for the alternate exit. I am otherwise playing this blind. And uh, the reason why I played ahead was I just wanted to make sure that I would be able to find it. However, there is also an alternate exit in level 8, and I have not checked that one out, so I have no idea what it is, or uh, what it will lead to. So we'll figure it out when we're there. Getting to this door is a little tricky. And here we go, treasure, Arr. This is what that alphabet is for. The special treasures. Yay, treasure. Okay, now we're gonna get out of here and find that alternate exit. Also, I did a bit of research. I read through the instruction book again just to make sure that I understood what everything was. And those hearts, they count towards 1-ups. And you collect money just because you're Wario. Wario likes money, and the ultimate objective is to get as much money as you can find. And hey, there's a heart. Also, our enemies are the Brown Sugar Pirates. What a scary name. And they are led by Captain Syrup. Also, this is apparently Kitchen Island, which the instruction book also calls Pirate Island for some reason. Maybe because they're just saying that this is where the pirates are? But I thought that was a little weird that there were two different names for the same place. Oh, and also Wario wants to buy a palace because he did not like the fact that Mario had a big castle. And hey, there's a hidden block there, which I did find before, but uh, that was off camera. So yeah, Wario wants a big palace that's better than Mario's castle from the previous game. And here's where the alternate exit is. That's pretty much all I have to say about uh, the things that I wasn't sure about in the previous video. Now I could try to get some bonus 1-ups. I'll give it a shot. Let's see if I can get any better at this. Oh, and it totally missed him, okay. I might just have to give up on these little mini-games if I don't get better at them. Okay, that did nothing. Ah, <laughs> Fail! Get him! What? Okay, well, I got one heart. Whoop-de-doo. 
I don't think I like those mini games. Probably because I am not very good at them. Okay, so what do we have here? And what is that? Oh, it's a crab. Money. Now, that was a complete surprise because I did not figure out what these things were when I was uh, figuring out the alternate exit off camera. Oh, hey! There's also hidden blocks. Well, I guess that makes sense. So I gotta make sure to look for hidden blocks. Get a lot of money. Well, I'm certainly doing a lot better than I did when I was uh, doing this off camera, so that's great. Glad I did that again. So, yeah, no more mini games. I, I don't like you, mini games. Okay. Now we're out of here. Going to Mount Teapot. Yes, let's finally get this started. And this looks like a water level. Oh, with birds. And I can't get that block. Definitely a water level. Oh, that's... Yeah, I had a feeling that was a bad thing. So they explode when you touch them. Okay. Good to know. Oh, and pressing down makes Wario dive. Which is... Hey, what? Okay, something tells me I won't be able to get back up there. Yep, okay, well... That was a thing. Ooh, blocks. Which I can't smash. Ooh, power up. Do I want that? Probably, because... Oh, hey, it's the uh, jetpack. Maybe I can smash... Yep, I can smash blocks now. And there's a door here. Checkpoint. Alright. I'm also kind of curious. Do the enemies respawn? Because what happens if you go through the entire level and for some reason you don't have enough coins to open the door? Are you stuck? Or do the enemies respawn, which means that you can just go through again and defeat some enemies and get some coins. Oh, get under there. And that looks like an evil seahorse, which... Get out of there, Wario! Heart. Now can I touch this thing and make that seahorse go away? Yes! Okay. That's good. Money, money, money. Oh, a 
heart. Okay, do I want money? Well, I want money and I also want the heart. Oh, good. I can just... Ooh. Okay. Right. You have uh, the spiky hat, so... You can take out enemies. Good to know. Oh, and apparently you can stick in the ceiling like that. <laughs> Which is kind of funny. I guess that's another thing that I found out from the instruction book. Okay, the next level should be level 8, which means there's an alternate exit in that level. I have not peeked ahead to this level, so I, I'm not sure what uh, what the level is. Basi okay, what level you get by um, accessing the alternate exit. I did, however, uh, look up online what you need it to do to get the alternate exit. So according to this, you need to be Jet Wario, and uh, just before the goal, um, there's an arrow of gold coins, or well, just regular coins, whatever, that uh, points up. And then you want to fly to the right. Using the jetpack. Die. I don't like you birds. Okay. I was gonna say what's in there, but uh, looks like I have to go in there anyway, so I'm gonna figure, find out what's in there. away. Oh, checkpoint, okay. Money, 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 money. Now, is there another heart over here? Nope. Thought there would be, just for symmetry's sake. Ooh, okay. And is there any coins in these blocks? No. Hmm. Evil pelican, die, evil pelican, or, or become a platform. That uh, that works too. I'm not gonna smash all those blocks. I know there's hidden stuff, but uh, just would take so long to bash all of these blocks. For all I know, I might be missing really good stuff. Ooh, okay, there's a, a current going on here. I want that block. And it was a heart, so I guess that's good. That was not good, however. I'm glad, by the way, that the enemies get uh, hurt and fly away when you're briefly invincible after getting hurt. That is very useful. Oh, hey, it triggers the blocks, too. Okay, I'm not gonna bother with that block. Or that block. Or maybe I will. No, there's, there's a current, so forget about it. Oh, okay, there's the arrow with the coins, so... Get rid of these guys. Get 
some money. Get a heart. Okay, jetpack over. Cool. What's this going to be now? And does that mean I have to go through the level to get the normal exit? Probably. to Sherbet Land, which I'm not going to go to because I don't want to skip ahead. But at least I got the alternate exit, so now I'm going to have to get the normal exit. Ah, oh, bird! I really don't like those birds. For some reason, Morio's spiky hat looks like um, Fred Flintstone's hat when he uh, went to the Royal Order of Buffaloes. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, just look it up. And sure, his hat was a furry hat, but it had uh, spikes on it. Ah! Bad. Now I guess I can get the money again. I'm not gonna bother getting the checkpoint though. Pelican, take that. Just go right to the end here. Not much point in getting all of these blocks. Although I do want to see what the, is in this block here. I am curious enough to try to figure that out. A heart. What's in this one? Okay, you can defeat it even with this hat. This game keeps surprising me. May as well get the heart. some money. Yay! Progress. And according to my notes, that's all the alternate exits for this particular area. So I can kind of just close my notes.
course number nine. Number nine, number nine, number nine. Interesting music. Not sure why that was so hard to say. I guess I should be taking out these enemies too and getting more money. There's a door up there. And there's a door there, okay. Uh, decisions, decisions. Oh, is there another? how you get up there. Oh, checkpoint. Okay, well, that's useful in case I lose a life. I actually have to pay attention to my lives because uh, I'm not particularly good at this game. It's different enough from a conventional Mario game that... Uh, that I feel that my Mario skills don't fully come into play. No pun intended. All oh, right, I keep forgetting you can do that. Get out of here. Take this key. Oh, I was just okay. I did seriously did not know about this. That was a complete accident. And I can't get in there because I don't have the proper power up. There's not even any hint that there's a door there. Okay, do I want to come back just to see what happens with the key? Ah, thing. Kind of looks like a bat. Hmm. Oh, right, there's... A, it could possibly be a treasure. I didn't make a note of where the treasures were. Right, I should have made a note. Okay, so I guess I will go back into that level and see if I can see if I can get the uh, treasure. Let's see if I can do this a little bit faster. Okay, the other one is a heart. 
And the enemy just got despawned. That's funny. Jump up. Thank you. And that's a checkpoint. Pretty sure I won't need it. And yes, I'm gonna get some money. Because I want a big palace. was not good. I really hope there's a power-up now. Okay, I guess I'll take a risk and get some money. Okay, good. Now just don't get hit. Go get the key. Wait for that guy. Treasure? Yes, treasure. A harp. Cool. Time to get out of here now. those things anyway. They're not bats. And I got 149 coins. I guess that's pretty good. Lots of money. Okay, here we go. Course 10. Oh. <laughs> Oops. That's pretty much the equivalent of dying on the first Goomba in Super Mario Brothers 1. Good. Power up. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> ah. Power up, give me, thank you. Nothing up there. Can't get in there. But I can get money from the crabs. be a way to get rid of those guys other than other than the bombs okay I can't crawl under there oh wait can I hit it with my hat no I cannot Sure, I could hit other things with my hat, but not that. Oh, 
I guess I'll get fire. I need a spiky hat. Ah, spiky hat. So what's in here? Ugh. I should have known. Now I can see what's in that door. Checkpoint? Is there anything useful down here? Money? And, um, a hole that I really think I should have been able to jump over? I don't know, that was a pretty cheap death, I think. Also, I apologize if my controller is really loud. I'm using my Genesis controller because it's not as loud as the Super Nintendo controllers that I have. But um, I found that it uh, still kind of gets picked up by the microphone. And I can only hold it so far away. My arms are only so long. Good. Done. Only 11 coins. Not too many. Course 11. You live. This music is kind of Interesting. I like it. No bird.
Okay, now I kind of wonder what was in the other direction. Well, if there's anything interesting in there, I'll uh, check it out once I'm done this area and uh, if there's anything interesting then I'll tack it on to the end of this video. So keep an eye out for that. Ah. What is this thing? It is a thing. Not a very useful thing. And right now, unfortunately, my uh, TV just turned off so I can't see anything. My apologies, I have to wait for it to turn back on. And that uh, was a complete accident because I couldn't see anything. Okay, and I'm back. So I'm going to unplug this now. I had to just uh, restart the recording program, capture card, whatever you want to call it. And now there is no lag. Stuck, got stuck in the ceiling. Ah! It's falling apart. Yay, the end. Thank you. Oh, I realize that Wario gives, gives you a thumbs up. Oh, is learning something new. gonna get to a boss or what? Course 12. Well that thing is not a pelican but it has a basket for a head. Okay, maybe I can get... Yep. Jetpack. Nope. Not, right, not a jetpack. It's the fire. The jetpack has wings. Why is it that uh, sleeping things in video games and uh, sometimes in anime have like bubbles? Maybe that's the Japanese equivalent of going zzzz. that thing? Yes, I can. This is very precarious.
Good, okay, that's done. Pirate Duck. Who has a name? A name that I forget. Okay, the boomerang went away. That was nice. Big exclamation cutscene. Okay, now it looks more like a teapot. So what did that do? Oh, okay. A boss? Course 13. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, no. Seahorse thing. Oh! That becomes a bomb. Was I able to stomp it? I need a power up. Thank you. Seems like the game was listening. Anything up? Oh, there is stuff up here. Cool. It looked pretty suspicious. Ah. Is there a power up in there, I wonder? Yes, good. I like the jetpack. Jetpack seems very useful. So I'm going to keep it. Or not, I'm not going to keep it. I'm going to, going to get hit. What's this? Heart. Should have known. Get out of there. Guess I'll go this way. Oh, boss time. Ah. Darn, what do I have to do? And I didn't get the checkpoint either.
Oh, come on. Give me the... <laughs> Yawn. <laughs> that was bad. That was also bad. Here we go again. Die. Okay, I guess I could just bash into it. That makes more sense. Okay, I'm gonna keep my spiky hat because the fire hat didn't seem to do much of anything. in here. Ah, checkpoint. Good. And what's over here? Probably hearts. What's down here? Stuff. A heart? Came all that way for a heart? One heart. Okay. Sure, totally worth it. Okay, boss time. At least it's a lot easier to break through the blocks. I'm just gonna see what's this way. Nothing? Nothing. Okay. That's, that's all you have to do? And I totally forgot that money rains down. Okay, that was, that was stupidly easy. And I died the first time. Great. And it looks like I'm finally done Mount Teapot. And uh, where am I now? Stove Canyon. 
Okay, so at this point I'm going to end the video here. However, if there's anything cool in uh, that place, that previous level with the alternate exit or whatever, the other way, I'm going to see if there's something there. And if there is, I'll tack it on to the end of this video. If not, then, well, this is the end of the video. So, thank you very much for watching. This has been a Yesterday's Moose production, and I'll see you next time.